what are we all going to be doing in two years' time? <laughs> yeah, well, that's the million-dollar question, I think. Yeah. Um, you know, I think that's one of the worries that we're seeing is that, uh, you know, what what happens if this happens again? Um, mm. And in, I guess the, the property industry didn't necessarily see a huge shift straight away. What I'm more afraid of is, you know, 12, 18 months down the track, um, and I guess what my clients are concerned about is, you know, what happens then? What happens when the government support is no longer available? Mm -hmm. And, you know, we do have to go back to life as normal, again, in inverted commas, but on our own. So, you know, that's been, I guess, the um, a bit of a dark cloud, um, which, you know, is echoing throughout all layers of the property industry. So we don't just work in retail, we work mm -hmm. quite a lot in office as well. So, you know, getting people to leave the house to go to work is now, you know, illegal in some states, but will we ever be able to get back to that? I think forecasting into the future, people are afraid of, of, of what that future holds and what will happen personally and professionally when the money runs out.